hello everybody welcome back to my channel my name is josie i'm so grateful you are here god bless you for watching me for today's video we're gonna do we're gonna stuff our cash envelopes i'm so glad i'm doing this you guys i want you to give it a try and just tell me whether it's good or not i've been doing cash stuffing for a long time but when i started doing videos about it i'm loving it more it makes you save a lot it doesn't make you overspend as you use the card so just give it a try it's really really helpful before i start my video i want to give a shout out to all my subscribers god bless you thanks for watching me there's a lot coming on this channel like i said on this channel we talk about everything simple living through jesus health and finances and today is one part of the finance so stay with me so i went to the bank and anytime i go have my wallet and this is the cash i stuff my cash with about 900 dollars, and i'll show you and i have this little bag that i put in so when i went to the bank i have all my money calculated for the cash envelopes and i know which amount i'm going to cash i know which dominations that i want so i told the cashier i wrote it at the back of my withdrawal sheet and they love it they are like oh my god you really making our job so easy so they really love it and i have my cash envelopes here so we will go ahead and empty that as well and i have this here also for my leftover so we're going to put the leftover in this one so i'll go ahead and empty my envelopes and my leftover i'm going to use it for something that is coming up this month september so i'll go ahead and empty it so for grocery it was level three dollars and some coins so i'll put that one here let me see if i have more money in some of them oh for gas it was level 20 dollars whoo i have money for savings i know there's nothing for pocket money i know there's nothing for clothing we didn't spend anything this month for clothing but normally for my clothing i don't spend it i know when it's time for us to go for shopping for clothing for the kids i have three kids and for myself and my husband we we buy a lot so i normally put it back i have a savings account for the kids so i'll go add it uh, when it's time for us to do clothing shopping we take the money from their savings then let me see toiletries oh i have money from there too i have 15 dollars from toiletry yes i love it when i have a leftover because I'm, i have something coming up so i'm going to use the leftovers to do that so i'll put my leftover in my envelope here so i'll go ahead and put everything here then we will put it aside okay so i have all my envelopes okay so let's see let's go ahead and arrange the money then i'll go ahead and do the stuffing so i have hundreds hundreds fifties And these are twenties. I'll put that one here. I have tens. I'll put that one here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I'll put that one. I thought I have some fives. But I don't. Let me check my book. I asked for fives okay I don't have fives so let's see this one here now let me bring my cash in the book here so that I know how I'm gonna draw it then I have my envelopes So these are my envelopes. I'll put that one here. Okay, so we're going to stop our envelopes. Nice. I love this. I love it. I love it. I love it. As you can see, for my monthly budget layout for September, the one I'm going to put it in an envelope, I have the envelope sign on the side. So 
as you can see i have it already here i'll go ahead anytime i'm doing budgeting video i just want to encourage everybody so let's go ahead and read the quotation for the month first corinthians 10 13 so what whether you eat or drink or whatever you do do it for the glory of god yes you have to do it for the glory of god it's very very important so let's st start staffing so for my food and grocery it gets 400 dollars so what I normally do, I'll do one. I'll do two of the hundreds. Then I'll do 150. Then I'll do two. Two of the 20s. Then I'll do 10. 110. So that will be 400. So 100, 200. No, three of the hundreds. I'm sorry. So 300, 50, then 50. So 400. Go to the food and grocery envelopes. So that one goes here. Then we do Kwame, my son. He gets 50. So for the 50 for my son, what I do is I do 120, 110. Then I'll do two tens. Then I'll do ones tens. So that'll be 50. So 20, 20, that's 40. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So that'll be for my son. I'll put that one here. And in my last video for cash envelope staffing, I explained to you why we, we give her $50 every month. He's a big boy now. He tests 10 this month. So for $50, he's going to pay tight on it. He's going to save. He's going to do spending. And last month, he didn't spend his money. So he still has it and he's so excited. Birthday is this September. So he's going to spend it, I'm sure. So we do that for him for 50 For toiletry and baby stuff, I have young ones, so I need that. For that one, is hundred dollars. So that one, I do five of the twenties, which is hundred dollars. So we put that one here. And last month, I didn't spend anything, so I have a leftover. That's free. For clothing, is fifty dollars, and that one I do one fifty, one of the fifties. So I put that one here. And for clothing, let me talk about clothing a little bit. What we do for clothing is that we don't spend our clothing money every month, but it's part of the four walls. So every month, $50 for clothing. So if I don't spend it this month, which I know we, everybody is in the house, so we don't do a lot of shopping. We are not a family that we shop a lot for clothing. So what I do is that I will take that money. Last month, I didn't spend it. This month, I'm sure I'm not going to spend it. I'll take that money and put it in the kids savings account. So when it's time for us to go do clothing shopping, we take the money from their savings, which we've already budgeting for every month. Then we go and we do a big shopping. I don't know when that big shopping is coming, but it will be here, I'm sure. So we do $50 every month. It's very important. It's part of the four walls. For my pocket money, I do $100. And that one, I will take 20s, five of the 20s, one, two, three, four, five. I love my pocket money. Last month in July, I save it and I use it for something. So I love my pocket money, $100 going there. For savings, it's $100. And that one, I'll do $100. I do savings every month. For the whole month, I do $100. That one is different from family savings that we do. This saving is for if something comes up, especially for myself, then I'll use it. So that one is aside. Then the last one is my gas, it's $100. So one, two, three, four, five. So last month I didn't spend all the money on my gas and I put it under my left tube. I'm so excited I didn't spend everything. That's why I lie up cash endless. Guys, go give it a try, I'm telling you. It's marvelous. So I have all my cash stuff in here. It's nice, 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 nice for everything here. I know next month I'm going to have more envelopes because Christmas is coming up. So I have to have a Christmas envelopes as well. I normally don't start saving for Christmas early. I start somewhere October. Then I'll save it for just three months because we don't do a lot of buying in Christmas. Just a few stuff. So that one will be part of it for my next month budget so this is how i do my cash staffing and i'll go ahead and put in this small bag that i got from 
clever force when I bought the eye envelopes. Mm, it's pretty much easy. If you start doing it, you will love it. I'm telling you, it will save you a bunch. So thanks for watching. I will see you in my next video. I love everybody. Thanks for subscribing. Don't forget to share, subscribe, comment. If you make a comment, I'll give you a shout out in my next video. And also, if you have any questions, just DM me on my Instagram. I also on Facebook. And also remember, I have a free budget sheet. Go download them. I'll leave the link in the description below. So go download them for free and use them for your budget. And tell me how it goes. Thanks for watching. God bless you. Thank you. And I'll see you in my next video.